Hey everyone and welcome back to Hayes Kitchen. After this week, we've got a really simple but packed full of flavor dish. We've got this Korean gochu yang and sweet chili glazed king oyster mushrooms with pok choy and steamed rice. Now for this recipe, I paired up with a company called Kamush. Uh, their foods are basically available at Tesco's. I've gone along and picked up this amazing king oyster mushroom. These are really well known within the vegan industry because they take on lots of flavours. They're really meaty like texture and they're really simple to get hold of these days. They also do the anoki mushroom, the beach mushroom and the oyster mushroom. All four have amazing different properties. The properties themselves, I'm not going to list all in this video, but I'm going to put it all in the description box down below. First things first, we're going to get a pan of boiling water on the go. To double quantities of water, we're going to add the rice. That's really been seasoned, so a nice generous amount of salt in there. We've got ourselves a bowl, and I've got two tablespoons of gochujang, which is like a Korean chili paste. And I'm using pureed here, so I'm using some pureed garlic and pureed chili. And I'm probably using about half a tablespoon of both of those. We're going to have a sweetness element here, so I've got a tablespoon of sugar. I've got half a cup of sweet chili sauce. And I've got a couple of tablespoons of soy sauce. Now for a real nice nutty flavour in there, I'm going to use some sesame oil. You can use sesame seeds, obviously. I've got a couple of tablespoons in there. And I've got some mirin as well. All I'm going to do with that is give it a really generous stir. And you get this beautiful paste. And into that, I'm going to take a chilli. Seeds as well. And that can go straight in. Now you'll get these little pockets, bites of heat going through there. Little mix, that can stick to one side while we get on with our oyster mushrooms. Now, simple with this. We're just gonna cut these into about, about 10 mil thickness, I would say. And I'm just simply gonna just crisscross across all of these. Now these type of mushrooms can be used for so many dishes. As I say, they are really the most perfect meat substitute. Now the great thing about the king oyster mushroom is it also contains a lot of B6. So that's the vitamin B6 and also vitamin C. So it's incredible for things like anti-aging properties and brilliant for the immunity. I'm simply gonna take our mushrooms, lay them down. I'm gonna allow these to get some of that flavor involved just pour your mixture straight over the top. Now if you want to know about the other three mushrooms within the K-Mush range, check out the description box down below which tells you all the different amazing properties within these mushrooms. So pan is nice and warm. We're going to go in with a little bit of oil, not too much. Right, this is nice and hot. So I'm going to simply, just going to lay these down. almost straight away you can smell you've got the caramelization of the sugars coming out of there we can just flip these over and you can see the beautiful little char marks on there and that's what you want you want that caramelization in there now we're going to deglaze the pan so a little bit of water in there just gives you those it releases all that sticky caramelization from the bottom of the pan and then i'm going to just start spooning in some more of our amazing chili sauce. Literally within a couple of minutes, as soon as you start seeing that change in the colorization, you know that caramel is gonna be amazing. So to place that into the oven, just to keep that warm. We're gonna get our pan back up to heat again and simply just take a few of our leaves of our patch away. I'm just gonna really quickly get a bit of heat through there and then we can serve this one up. They literally take a matter of seconds. That heat can come off. We've got a generous amount of our rice. Our beautiful crispy pieces of pak choy. Wee, 
And now our beautiful sweet chili soya glaze go-to yum. Mushrooms can just go straight over the top. sprinkle a nice little bit of spring onion just around the top. So there we have it, that is my Korean go-to young sweet chili sauce glazed king oyster mushroom with a simple pop joy and rice. It's super tasty, super easy to do, so get recreating it. Now if you do recreate any of my dishes, hashtag me as Haste Kitchen across all social platforms. Go and check out Kamush, all the details are in the description box down below. Go and check out their other four mushrooms, get recreating it, and I'll see you soon. Cheers then, bye bye.